Lincoln has already locked up a Holiday Bowl berth. A little later this year, they have won it with a 7-0 record. BYU at 4-1, looking for a major bowl of their own. UTEP, a positive season. The Miners at 4-2. Hawaii at 3-2. And the Falcons with that very potent offense, the wishbone attack, three and two. Now that last group, Utah has really struggled defensively. They're two and four. San Diego State's disappointing one and four record. Colorado State, the one win against the Aztecs. And Mike Shepard's New Mexico Lobos have not won a game yet this year. Slide, and he's upended there. 6'3", 205-pound sophomore, playing ahead of Brad Platt, who has played most of the year. You can see the numbers. Not a lot of throws because Platt had been at the controls. Play action on first down. Out of the backfield to the running back. That's Hewitt. Paul Hewitt and Jennings. Gilbert, who's caught 22 consecutive games with at least one pass. Rowe, who made the return, and Kerry Reed Martin, one of 16 seniors, playing their final game. Twiana, Fortin, Wells is a good one. Subas and Baldwin up front. Second down and six for the Aztecs, and Rowe goes in motion. Second back through, and it's Hewitt, and he dances for three, and he's a yard shy of a first down. protection again on the short throw he has a first down Kerry Reed Martin the tight end with his 25th catch of the year and the Aztecs have a first throw into the right the tight end marked in motion and again they use play action two on second down and ten He's to the 45 to the 44 yard line. Running back Paul Hewitt. Peter Paul led the nation in scoring last year. Martin, did he come up with it? It's rolled a completion and a first down. The tight end Kerry Reed Martin. Likes of Tim Delaney, Don Warren, and Robert Awalt. I like Kerry Reed Martin. Good protection again. The key is the protection. They are protecting Scott Barrett well. And Broom comes up with the catch. Michael Broom, he too, one of the seniors, one of 16 playing their final game for Lavelle Edwards. And there's Bob Davis who made the stop. We'll see Dale possession and driving. 11.42 left first quarter. Hewitt dances inside the 25-yard line. Davis, Hewitt to the 20. He has a first down to the 18-yard line. The 17-yard line out of the eye formation. Hewitt, 15. He slices for a first down to the 14-yard line. Again, on, the, on third and 10. They didn't see Ferguson coming. And the right cornerback was blitzing, and nobody laid a glove on. Ferguson has had a very productive year. Jimmy Ray will put it down. We'll call it the 30-yard line, making it a 40-yard attempt. Well within the range of Ackerson. Eight minutes, 55 seconds in the first quarter. It is the Aztecs trying to get on the board first. It is good. Tyler Ackerson gives San Diego a 3-0 lead with 8.49 left. First quarter. Of course, this... This is a different Aztec team than what we've seen in the past. Second and a short four. Yet it's Hewitt. Scores to near the two-yard line. Hewitt, and this time they stack it up. Nowhere to go. Peterson coming out of the secondary. 24 touchdown. That's Kerry Reed Martin in motion. The deep pitch to Hewitt. He flies. Touchdown. The first quarter, 10-3 Aztecs. Play action. Covey still has it. He's looking deep for Franzen. That 
excellent coverage. There were three back there. Jeff. That's Bellini in motion. Covey running for his life. Duncan gets him from behind. There's that freshman again. Right down the name, Eric Duncan, because he's put some life into that. Three of five on third down conversion. Looking to third and two here. Hewitt has a first down and much more as he drags tacklers inside the 10-yard line. Hewitt bounces outside, then back inside. He's inside the five-yard line. The same one. Again, it's Hewitt. And his leg strength buys him a couple yards to the throw in consecutive seasons. On third and goal, it's Hewitt again. Still trying to get in and does that second effort. Momentum gets him over the goal line. Tyler Ackerson makes it a 17-3 game. And that's the advantage for San Diego State. 13 minutes, 11 seconds left first half. It's a good one. Got the team starting from the Cougar 41-yard line. Incomplete. Of course, about Scott Barrick, who's ignited this Aztec team. Just like Ty Detmer did a week ago against New Mexico. Flushed out of the pocket. Intended for Smith, and that's incomplete. Convert on third down. 0 for 3. And it's third and 10 again. They show blitz, and here they come. And they sack him. Mario Mitchell, the quarterback. They sent the troops. Well, Ty Detmer's got to protect himself in that situation. That was a show, a show dog all the way. As a quarterback, you've got to be able to see that they're blitzing, and you know that you, your people can't keep them out that long. This is a hit that he takes that he's responsible for. He doesn't have Booker. Well, great speed is so hard to defend here. Booker, with him, they want to get him outside. He's a well-built kid, but he's got the great speed. Brad Peterson is six foot four, two twenty-five, almost a face mask call there on Booker. It should have been a flag. Twenty-four to three in favor of San Diego State in the final twenty seconds of this half. And Ty Detmer trying to get his team on the board. to three. And 3.45. And it's Hewitt again. Well, this time he stood up and down he goes. Points. San Diego State record. Try to build on that. Well, you saw Washington State stun UCLA on prime ticket. Here's another big stunner in the West. To the far corner. Touchdown. Monty Gilbert. Five-yard attempt. Remember he had one blocked earlier tonight. This one's down and up and perfect. 27. The Cougars from Provo, Utah with only nine. And when this score, Wolf Wright, Iowa State, 52-31. We're down to a minute. Chris Smith slides down at the six-yard line. When they beat... 59 seconds left. 27-9 and Coming. For Chris Smith. Touchdown. So it's not Chuck Cutler's night. For Bellini. BYU Cougars will they all right in the top 20. It is San Diego State prevailing 27 to 15. And they let it from start to finish. And they quite simply look like the better football team on this evening. There you see Lavelle Edwards congratulating Denny Stoltz. A tough year for this man. He's taken some heat here in the community, but he kept his team together when they could have gone in the tank. They came out, they dominated this game throughout. 7-15, our post-game show.